Hello YouTube, I'm your favorite Quarian here, and today I got an unboxing for you. This is the Denix Luger P08 Parabellum. Now, this is uh, my first unboxing, so just bear with me if I'm too bad. So let's go ahead and get started. I already got the package open, so we're going to open it and just find what's the contents inside. Now, I purchased this um, Luger off of Amazon for a total of $76. Uh, $76. Um, plus, I think it was around six dollars for shipping, so it costed around eighty-two dollars or sixty-five euros or seventy-five pounds or whatever, however you like to say it. But um, this cost—that's how much it costs. In case if you want to get one, if you wish to get one yourself, just type in Didix Luger. So, after throwing the package away and opening it, you get a box like this. Standard Denix box. This is like the um, every other gun box that you get out of. Um, the side right here has more markings on the box. Denix and another part in the back. The box is relatively heavy, so I'm gonna go ahead and um, set this down. So we're gonna turn this. So this is how the box looks. As you get out of every, probably every other gun you get that's made by Denix as you can see made in Spain just every other part every other detail any information on the box is on there so it doesn't tell what gun it is just the name of the company so remove this tape here okay so let's set up here alright so this will open up the top right that comes off so we open it for what we see what we find. So right here, you with every other Denix gun, you get a catalog, which if you open it shows every other Denix gun that you have. It's um front and back, so you can hang this up on a wall or you can just set it to a side. We'll set that side for later. Open it here. You get a um, manuscript, a, a receipt. This is just any standard receipt that you get, but um, that's about what it's there for. Tells you the price that you pay, shipping balance. Like I paid eighty-two dollars for mine, so you set that aside here for later. And now, finally, what we've been waiting for: the gun itself. So let's set the box over here. This is the gun. The um, main body is made of polished metal. The uh, grip is plastic. So we can, you can see right here. I don't know if you can see it, but um, let me bring it up. It's a Denix made in Spain. It's probably right there. You can see it. If we flip it, it's got more markings right here of course it says right here parabellum p08 the grip is made of plastic more polyester it's not that cheap plastic it's actually quite decent uh, the front sight right here everything else is made of metal um, oh, the safety does not work does not move the switch right here to where it disables the entire gun um, does not work the magazine up oh, comes out. This is the magazine of the gun. Doesn't look big enough to hold a chamber any nine millimeter, but it's got a spring here. Which of course, if you pull down, you can pull about that far, which you can go up to about here. Can't pull it down any more farther. It won't let you because of some sort of resistance that's going on to the bottom of the gun. The um. Bottom right here is sort of wobbly, but um, that's really unnoticeable. To, to insert the magazine, put a magazine front forward, and it fits in, slides in, just perfect. Um, what I've noticed, all Denix guns, the front of the barrel is orange plug, but um, in case if you don't want that orange plug, there's probably a way to either remove it or you can just color it in with Sharpie. The sights are like a real Luger 
I can just line it up. It's about like that for real sights. Um, the the um, handle looks like it can charge. So yes, the handle does charge back. Charge on this side. Charge it wherever. And of course, if you fire it, your fire can go off. So that's basically much all I could say about the Luger. Other than that, this is a really, really cool prop that you can use. And um, I'd say this is worth the money. It's really, I really, really love this. This is really great. Go ahead and pick the camera up and show you a little bit more close detail. Push, press the button here. Magazine once again. As you can see, can only go about this far. And like that. Sights. This is a all I'd say is this is a really cool prop. So um, thank you for watching and uh, as always have a nice day.